things we do to get a thumbnail. Hi guys, and welcome to today's long overdue video. We are going to do a huge Marshalls and TJ Maxx haul again today. I have been meaning to shoot this video for months. If you do like this video, I hope you'll give me a big thumbs up. And if you aren't subscribed, I hope you will consider subscribing before you go. So if you wanna see what I got this go around, then keep watching this haul. Okay, so PS you guys, I used some of the hair products that I picked up at the Premier Orlando trade show. I'm really liking them. Usually by now, setting up with the lights and all of that, I have to go back in and re kind of like smooth out my hair with the blow dryer. I use that Revlon One Step hair brush. I did a video on it. I'll put it up in the cards right here. Click that eye. You can check that brush out. It is such a time saver. But I really think that leave-in treatment, that Redken leave-in treatment, and the Moroccan Shine Spray, like especially when I have my hair straight, is really making a difference. So enough about that, let's jump into product. First I'm gonna show you the San Tropez Gradual Tan Plus Sculpt and Glow. So according to this, it says it's an everyday multi-active toning lotion. Toning. I didn't even realize that when I got it. And I found it for $2.99 at Marshalls. I've never used this particular product by Saint Tropez, but I have used just like their original tanning formula and I really did enjoy it. So this was exciting to find four of. And like last time, I will be doing a giveaway. I'm not sure exactly how I'm going to format it because I want to make sure that one of my current supportive subscribers is going to win. I think I'm going to do two winners this time. We'll have to see. I was going to do it when I got to a thousand subscribers, but I have been sitting pretty at like 900 subscribers. I keep going a little bit under and then a little bit over and it's just, it is what it is. But I want to thank you guys for all of the support that I have gotten, especially over the last couple months because my life has been a little bit rough. So really appreciate you guys being there for me. Let's keep going. Also by San Tropez, I found this In Shower Gradual Tan Lotion. This looks promising. And again, found this at Marshall's for $2.99. I was just really excited to find some of these tanning products. I think it's perfect for summer and it's kind of like body products. So continuing in that theme, I found the Alginist Reveal Luminizing Drops and this is in the shade Rosé. And this, you guys, is so pretty. I have used liquid luminizing drops before and either they're just too crazy like the cover effects drops I have to really work with because they're so blinding and then I've used some other ones that I don't know they pick up powder products and they're just kind of a pain to use this is beautiful I found this I accidentally threw out the box so this one I'm actually going to be keeping for myself but I found it at TJ Maxx I did see it at Marshall's as well I believe it was nine dollars and ninety nine cents just to show you what it looks like it has a dropper applicator and I just use a very little bit so hopefully that picks up but it's really beautiful on its own or underneath a highlighter. Another thing I really like about it, there is no sparkle in it. There is no micro glitter, none of that. It is just like wet looking. So love that. Moving on, let's do some kits. And this is the Bare Minerals two-piece limited edition collection illuminator and brush. And like last time, I did find most of these products, actually all of them, I believe, except that Alginist product at Marshalls. And this was $14.99. The packaging on this is really pretty. I don't want to mess it up because I will be giving this away. Eh, it's so hard. Good Lord, Bare Minerals. You guys, I literally cannot get it open. 2,000 years later. Holy crap. 
All I have to say is these Impress nails are freaking amazing. If you didn't see my video on these nails, I'm gonna link it up here as well because I cannot believe that not a single one of these nails just popped off with the struggle I had trying to get this out of that packaging. In any case, this is what she looks like on the inside. The color is called Gold Obsession. It is cream, which is why it comes with this synthetic brush to apply it with. I'm not gonna open it up, but it looks basically like a foundation brush with a pointed tip, which will be nice to get a beautiful, luminizing, precise application. And sticking with kits, this box is a bit beat up, but everything inside is untouched. And this is the Lorac Live Color Festival Essentials Kit. You open it up and you get this uh, cute little pouch. I thought this was adorable. And you get their illuminating primer, a mini hydrating lip stain in Alter Ego, their full size Pro Lash Pomade Mascara in Noir Black as well as their blush, which is a matte shade in Technicolor. And all of this was found at Marshalls for $14.99. Next up, this was pretty exciting. I'm going to give it away even though I love this product myself, but this is the Bare Minerals Lashes All Around Kit. And this includes a full-size lash domination mascara as well as a mini, and they are in the shade black. I found it for $9.99 at Marshalls. Next up, I found another Lorac kit. This is the Take Me To Tan Tango Front of the Line Pro Eye Pencil Set. In here, you are getting the shade Antique Gold, Rose Bronze, and Teal. So again, you can see that it retails for $30 with a value of 60 right there and I found it for nine dollars and 99 cents again at Marshall's all right what's next let's move into the palettes so first up is the Anastasia contour kit it's the powder contour kit and this is the light to medium and I found her at Marshall's again and this was $18.99. You get a banana powder. This one I was really intrigued to try because Jaclyn Hill always used to talk about it. And then you get a highlight shade. This is like a matte highlight. And then three contour shades. And I mean, color-wise, they're just fine. Formula-wise, though, I have an easier time blending out my Profusion contour makeup case for $6.99 and I still paid $18.99 on this and for me this would be a pass like if you were thinking of getting it I wouldn't even get it at the discounted price save your money and get the, the profusion one that you can pick up at Target is freakingbomb.com this is the cargo emerald city palette and I picked this up at Marshall's for $9.99 sense this is what the palette looks like on the inside it's actually really pretty it comes with a dual ended synthetic brush i don't know if you guys are going to be able to see that next up this was really pretty and different this is the stila eyes are the windows palette shadow palette eyes are the windows they don't make body anymore it's really pretty i assume it just wasn't selling as well who knows but I did get it for $7.99 at Marshall's. It comes with a little lookbook, which is pretty cute. And then the packaging is really pretty on it. Here are what the shades look like in the palette. And I feel like uh, this shade right here, this these blues are like really on trend for the summer. So that's exciting. Last up in the palettes is the Makeup Forever 9 Artist Shadow Artistic palette and here is what the palette shades look like really pretty and they all look like shimmer shadows oh shoot i just touched the teal one by accident so if you guys get this and you see a fingerprint that was me i'm sorry do like this packaging it's like a tin very cool and i found this at marshall's for 14 dollars 99 next up i found an anastasia eyeshadow single and this is in the shade plum smoke and i found it for four dollars 99 at marshall's and then i picked up the same shade i actually found in my previous haul catnip and that was one of the shades i kept for myself because it's just this a really 
pretty bright berry. Let me go ahead and show it to you. This is a liquid lip. I don't remember if I saw that. And I feel like on my lips at least, it dries down. I mean, most liquid lips dry down a little bit darker, but I feel like it almost looks pinkier. It dries down like more <sighs> berry, like grape berry, but it's beautiful for summer. I found this one at Marshalls for $7.99. And then I found this gloss for $7.99 as well. Um, I believe when I picked up the first haul that I did, they were $6.99. So I think they went up a dollar. This is a really beautiful gloss shade. It's called Date Night. And it has, I don't think you're gonna be able to see the reflect in it, but it does have a reflect. It's kind of like a gold and pink reflect maybe it's really beautiful all right and then last but not least i found this Too faced mascara it is their size queen mascara in black and it comes with a really big brush i've personally never used this mascara before but hey why not and i picked this one up at marshall's as well for nine dollars and 99 cents all right, you guys, so that wraps up this TJ Maxx Marshalls haul. I really should just call it a Marshalls haul. Anyways, I had fun. I hope you had fun too. When I figure out just how I'm gonna do this giveaway, I will let you guys know. I'm gonna have to work on that. But anyways, I am being really goofy. I'm in like a super goofy mood. Thanks so much for watching. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, I hope you'll give me a big thumbs up. And if you are not subscribed, I hope you will consider subscribing before you go. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching. Bye. Baby, why don't you just meet me in the middle? I'm losing my mind just a little. So why don't you just meet me in the middle? In the middle. Why does it take me so long to film? I mean, I have been filming for I don't even know how long. 525,600 minutes. 525,000 moments so dear 525,600 minutes How do you measure, measure a year? In daylight, in sunsets, in midnights, in cups of coffee Okay, Allison, enough.